13 on your side weather deck is brought to you by Montel Construction. Quality made simple. Welcome back. It's going to be a cool day today. Many of us are still in the 60s. Very slow to climb as the sun has been very slow to make an appearance today. But we are going to see the same thing tomorrow before we heat up just in time for the weekend. Let's take a look at the weather ball. It is solid or I should say it's blinking green today, so we're going to see no change for seen to temperatures. Another cool day as we climb to the upper 70s and we'll also see some rain in sight for a select few. This view brought to you by Ace Hardware Stores of West Michigan. Muskegon dry right now and a little sunshine out there, 68, but those of us that are inland still a little on the cool side with those temperatures in the mid 60s inland because of the cloud cover. But we're starting to get some sunshine developing. We've also had a few light showers popping up just east of US 131, which is where we expect them to be this afternoon. If you do see any at all, Ionia County seeing a couple of those lighter showers to Montcalm County as well. And also we're finally going to see those temperatures into the 70s this afternoon. Might be a tough call to get to 77 at this point for us in Grand Rapids, but Lakeshore areas should be warming up into the 70s here shortly. As for the rest of the afternoon, look for pretty much dry conditions on the lakeshore, but I think those of us inland still face the threat of a quick shower around US 131 in east will dry out by the evening hours and continuing into the overnight with dry conditions, but patchy fog might be something we see early tomorrow. We'll otherwise see some sunshine, but as we get into the afternoon hours, more shower chances. We've got spotty showers coming in the afternoon and maybe even a little bit of a, a thunderstorm or two. As we get into the evening, we once again will start to dry out and into uh, Saturday, a dry day for us before showers come that night. So at least we get one full dry day to start off the weekend. Temperatures pretty quiet in the interim. We'll stay pretty cool too in the 70s today, 70s tomorrow and look at this dew points staying pretty low through it all. We will have these edging up into the lower 60s tomorrow. I think it's going to be just on the cusp of feeling uh, humid, especially with the cool temperatures, not too noticeable. But as we get into Saturday and the rest of the weekend, yeah, it's going to feel pretty steamy here shortly. Looking at the South Haven Beach view, it's pretty quiet there. 66 right now and some sunshine. We're also going to see pretty quiet conditions no matter where you are on the beach. So looking very quiet, but not exactly warm. We did have some temperatures really drop off like 55 in Grand Haven State Park, which by the way, authorities are saying avoid that area for a while as a situation is happening there. But for the rest of the beaches, some 60s, some 70s, it's a little cold in spots. Temperatures today in the mid 70s to upper 70s for the lakeshore inland areas. If we see clearing in time enough, 76 for Big Rapids, Fremont too, and farther south, 77. Again, if we get the sunshine popping here just a little while. Looking at your 13 on your side forecast, we've got temperatures staying in the 70s for one more day, then jumping to the 80s by the weekend, and we're feeling humid as well. Some scattered showers and thunderstorms possible Sunday before we dry out for next week. We'll also keep the heat and humidity going. So first day of school coming next week, and it's going to be pretty steamy, but we'll see a slow downhill slide into the more comfortable low 80s by the following weekend.